Hey, it's Amy Joy, and I'm coming to you post Healing the Heart Space retreat with Honors English and Jason Harrison. And I really enjoyed my time at the retreat. Um, ooh, I learned so much about myself there. I wasn't expecting that. I'm a very introspective person, and I guess the shadow side to that is kind of um, being a little arrogant, thinking that. Uh, you know, I'm so smart, I'm so enlightened, like I don't have anything else to learn. So um, I wouldn't say that I went into it like thinking that exactly, but I wasn't expecting to really come away with what I did. And so that was definitely a pleasant surprise. Um, going in, you know, I had a little resistance about being in group, not sure if people would be like projecting egos, you never know what you're going to get, especially in a group situation. And what I found when I got there was that everybody was completely open, no projection of egos, everybody accepted me, welcomed me, um, I felt like we were all on the same accord. That was wonderful. Um, during the exercises at the retreat, um, we, again, we were really, really, really open, every single one of us, um, so much so that I felt like at times we were definitely kind of jumping out of our bodies and into each other's, our spirits were definitely dancing and intertwining with each other, um, we connected as one um, with a unison of breath. And um, it was a really, really good time. We had a lot of transformational work. A lot of people's heart chakras were able to open right then and there in those moments. For myself, I still have a little bit of work to do in that area, but I did come to learn about myself and how I am processing um, heart energy. And um, I was able to have a lot of heart a lot more heart openings actually I did have some during the retreat but also a lot more post retreat on my flight home as I was sitting there reflecting upon the retreat I could physically feel my heart chakra opening up more and more of that energy and that um, you know stirring with inside my chest and you know sometimes it feels a little warm um, so I learned a lot about, like I said, how I process energy, how I'm processing my feelings. Um, and the guys were really funny. They were so funny. Everybody there was so funny and um, very, 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 very fun to be around. Um, the environment, the environment created was such a safe place and a really great place to do work introspection um, to explore yourself inside and also kind of like outside right so like um, processing internally but also processing like how you're being um, amongst like others as well um, and having those others there are def is definitely like a really transformational tool growth tool because um, it allows us to like fully accept ourselves um, by being kind of witnessed and held by others as well and having them be like you know no judgment it's okay everything you're saying doing being feeling I accept you you're able to then also do the same for yourself so I definitely 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 recommend coming to the healing the heart space retreat with honors English and Jason Harrison um, you know I might do it again y'all might see me at the next one um, is a great way to either you know reinforce and infuse your regular techniques and routines um, with a extra boost turbo boost of heart energy or you know energy to all your chakras um, it's also a great method or means to um, get started if you're looking to get started into some type of meditation regimen and routine and it's also a really great way to reinvigorate yourself and become more inspired or motivated to continue on your path so if, it, if that 
fits any one of you out, out there, which might be every one of you out there, seems like there's only three categories to be in, um, I would definitely recommend coming to the retreat. Um, hit, hit honors up, aka Jay English or Jason Harrison. Um, hit them up and come to, come to the retreat and hopefully I'll see you at the next one.